right. Hey, everybody. Um, so I want to talk really quick um, about your cookie banner um, and Wix. So if you have Wix and you have a cookie banner, um, Wix just changed something. So I wanted to bring it to your attention. Uh, so for instance, if I go to my website, <clears throat> Um, I don't have anything popping up saying cookies and we need to. Uh, so if you go to a site and they get that annoying pop up, um, let's see if CNN does it. Um, but you get, actually, they don't really store cookies. Um, let's try, I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Uh, anyways, uh, you get those little things that say like, hey, click me. Uh, well, there were ways to do it and they got outdated. So now Wix has created a way to do it on their site. So I wanted to walk you through that really quick. So when you go to Wix and you log in, um, what you're going to do is click on the site that you are clicking on. So let's just go back to the beginning here. So if you have more than one, you'll see this. You're just going to go ahead and click on one and go select and edit sites. Um, and then what you're going to do is come on down here to the bottom left. Uh, settings over here on the left and you're gonna go to privacy and cookies and then what you're gonna do is it's gonna bring this right here display cookie consent click get started click this little thing right here to make it blue and then you're gonna choose now for me and my website um, I like to make it you want it people to kind of notice it so you want it to stand out so if the bottom of my site is white or black I could go either way if it's white you might want to go with the dark mode um, for me, it probably doesn't matter too much because of the coloring of my page uh, at the moment. Uh, but then what you're going to do is go ahead and click consent button. Uh, just leave that, leave that. Um, you should, every site should have a privacy policy, a terms of service, um, an ADA statement if you've gone through that. Um, and uh, terms of service, privacy policy. Uh, and there's another one that I'm drawing a total blank on. Uh, but all your sites should have this. So if you have one, cool, leave that. Um, you can leave this the way it is. And when you come down to the privacy policy, this is where you're gonna tell it where to go if you have one. So for me, if you already have a page that has it, then you would go ahead and just put it and link it that way. Or you can go to an external site if you did it through another way. Um, so for me, uh, I'll create one and then click this and then choose the page and it will go to that. Then you're gonna click I've read and understood uh, and then save and publish. Now, since I don't actually have a privacy policy right now, I'm gonna go ahead and remove this so that it doesn't see that, say that. Um, and then I'm gonna go ahead and click save and publish. And it's gonna say, hey, you don't have a privacy policy, are you sure? And say yes. Uh, and once you do one, have one, you can come back here and fix that. So now if I go to the website, oh, I was doing it on a different site, sorry. You'll see I have a box pop up and this is that cookie box that your site needs to have. Um, so hope that helps for you Wix people who have a website. Let me know if you've got questions as always. Bye.